All right, guys, so welcome to my vlog. This is about my fifth intro. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. So I decided to take you guys on a walk with me today because I haven't been able to record my actual vlog. And so today I'm walking outside and talking to you guys, which is quite weird because I'm holding a big ass camera with a big ass lens and my hand is hurting. But uh, yeah. The control free that I am wouldn't actually do this because I like things to be in a control setting but today I'm out here vlogging my walk and sharing it with you guys I've been up to a lot of things this week that's why I missed out on recording my actual vlog and they have been creative endeavors as well so I'll fill you guys in when I can but in the meantime my hands are really really tired and I have to say a big shout out to all the people who actually do vlogging because it's not the easiest thing to do to walk in town with a big ass camera recording yourself and not feel like, yeah, you are the weird one. I can't even look at the real camera because it's not something I do. So big shout out going out to Kujo Edem. You recorded your vlog and uh, let me switch hands. Yeah, you recorded your vlog and I was inspired by it. Also big shout out going out to Kezi Nana, yeah, you do vlogging and I don't, I don't do very well with being spontaneous. So this is really out of my comfort zone, going on a morning walk. It's about 6.51 here in Chado, well, here in Accra, yeah, it's not here in Chado. And uh, you guys are welcome to my morning walk and doing things out of your comfort zone. I don't know if I'm going to be able to post this this morning because my recording or my release date for my YouTube vlogs is usually Thursdays and I'm recording this on a Thursday morning because I missed out on recording it so yeah this should be fun doing an actual vlog and <laughs> people aren't staring <laughs> it's all in my head but I think they are because this is this is this is really obnoxious but anyway uh, my hands are getting tired, so I'll take a pause here and record more when I can. So the guy going there actually, ooh, let me see, yeah, recognize me from YouTube. Oh, this feels good. <laughs> anyway, so my walk usually. Let me turn this around. My walk usually, uh, wait, I'm out of focus. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I mean, I'm in focus now. I'm in focus now. Yeah. So my walk usually um, is from my house, which is around the Gulf Indian Station, Nachado, all the way. Am I still out of focus? Am I? No, I'm not. Okay, so all the way to the Labadi Beach Road. And then I go around the trade fair and then back home. It takes about an hour in total. But I'm sure with these recordings, it's going to take way longer because I'm pausing to record things and I'm walking. Usually I do jog a little bit. So yeah, still taking you on my walk this morning and doing things out of your comfort zone. I'm a control freak. At that and so it's not easy for me to do the things I'm doing right now or the thing I'm doing right now and I hope to be able to do more of this because it's not a norm in Ghana for you to be walking around with your camera and pointed at yourself and talking to it so to more of traditional vlogging guys uh, I'm in front of the trade fair right now it's halfway through my walk and this is where actually a couple of friends of mine skate they build everything by themselves there's no actual skate park here in Accra this is one of the very few places that they're able to skate and practice their sport so yeah in the mornings it's for other people to exercise in the evenings usually the boys are here skating 
And uh, I want to talk to you about leaving things be. Let me turn the camera. So, I never thought for the life of me vlogging in Accra that I'll be sitting here <laughs> on a Thursday morning actually talking to a camera in town. I didn't think I'd do that because I find it a bit uncomfortable, like I said before, doing this kind of traditional vlogging. But here I am, sitting at the skate park on a Thursday morning, talking to the camera. So, this, I think for me, the lesson I'm taking here today is the fact that, well, you never know until you try and you never say never to anything. Like I said, I am a control freak. That's why I like to have a control setting with most of my recordings. But today I decided to just do something different and take you guys on my walk. And just have a fun conversation together while I walk. Now, the issue with my walking usually is that I tend to break out in hives and get a runner's itch. So I'm not really a fan of it. I try to do it every day because the more you do it, the more you get out of the itching and the hives and whatever and the allergic reactions that I get on my arms. But yeah, I am going to be doing more of this. I have really, I wouldn't say completely enjoyed it, but I'm going to be doing more of this because I think it's fun to just be spontaneous sometimes and do whatever you want. I should have been home by now, but I've taken it easy today just talking to you guys. So this is my walk vlog in Accra and you don't often see people do this here so I think I'm actually the first person to carry a camera and sit around and talk to it in the neighborhood. I don't know if anybody else has done it somewhere else. Well, could you them did it in a bush somewhere. But yeah, it doesn't happen often in Accra. I'm a bit tired, so I'm gonna go home now. Yeah. All right, guys, so I'm actually almost back home. I think it's too dark. And uh, leave you there. Yeah, I'm actually almost back home, and I am so uncomfortable because I broke out in hives. Not because I haven't done this in a while, but apparently it doesn't count when you walk on a treadmill or run on a treadmill in the gym. And uh, funny thing I discovered today is that you think people are not watching? They actually are. I was spotted by three people, at least three people who know me and texted another person to call me like, yo, your boy is actually walking on the streets with his camera like a madman. <sighs> Let me open the gate. <sighs> oh. <sighs> so yeah. So, I'm back home and my usual one hour walk became a whole two hours and breaking out in hives. I'm still not used to talking to the camera without looking at the monitor. That's why I keep stealing peeps there. And my arm is tired. I'm gonna edit this. It takes a lot of guts to do this in Accra. So it's peace for now. Cover it up. All right guys, so this is what I was talking about, breaking out in actual hives after going for a walk. Um, viewer discretion is advised, if I should say. Um, it usually happens when I haven't exercised for a while, but the strange thing is I have been exercising quite frequently. So I don't get how I'm still breaking out in hives after going for my morning walk. I don't get it. Apparently treadmills don't count as exercising. And it's on my back as well, everywhere. My body's allergic to react, I mean, allergic to exercising. I'm, I'm tired. I'm really tired.